Hello everyone, it's Erin, and welcome back to another video tutorial. In this video, I'll be showing you how to transfer cross-chain assets on Moon River. Cross-chain assets are native substrate assets that can be transferred between a pair chain and the relay chain, or other pair chains connected to the same relay chain. On Moonbeam, they are referred to as XC20s. XC20s are cross-chain assets that have an ERC20 token interface to maintain Ethereum compatibility, so you can interact with XC20s as you would with any other ERC20. For example, you can add them to MetaMask and create liquidity pools on DEXs. All XC20s have XC prepended to their name, so Kusama's KSM representation on Moon River is known as XCKSM. For a deeper dive into XCM and XC20s, including an overview of the protocols that enable XCM, how assets are registered, and more, you can check out the Moonbeam documentation site. Links to the doc site are in the description below. All right, so now that you have a base understanding of XC20s, let's get started and interact with some XCKSMs. You can also adapt this guide for other XC20s. You'll need MetaMask to interact with the assets on Moon River, and then you'll also need Polkadot.js extension to interact with Kusama. To get started, go ahead and navigate to apps.moonbeam.network slash moonriver. Just take a minute to review the terms and conditions and click accept. Next, MetaMask will pop up. If you haven't already signed in, enter your password and click unlock, then choose the account you want to connect and transfer XCKSMs with. Once you've selected your account, click connect to continue. If you haven't already added Moon River as a network, you will then be prompted to add the Moon River network and connect to it. So go ahead and click approve and then switch network. Now your MetaMask should be connected to the Moon River network and the DAP should show you the Moon River page. If you take a look at the cross chain assets section of the DAP, you'll be able to see all of the available XC20s on Moon River. To get more information about each XC20, you can hover over their name to find out the origin network, name, and decimals for that asset. And for each XC20, you'll be able to easily deposit, withdraw, and add the XC20 to MetaMask. First, let's start off by adding the XCKSM token to MetaMask. So go ahead and click Add to MetaMask, and MetaMask should automatically pop up and prompt you to add the token. Click Add Token. To make sure that it was added successfully, you can open MetaMask back up and under the Assets tab, you should see the XCKSM token. Now you can deposit some XCKSM tokens to Moon River from Kusama. Before getting started, make sure that your Kusama account is connected to Polkadot.js extension and has some KSM tokens available to transfer. So to get started, click on Deposit, then click Connect to Polkadot.js. The extension will pop up and to connect the extension to the dApp, you can click Yes, allow this application access. Next you can start to fill out the deposit information to transfer some KSM to Moon River. Make sure the Kusama Relay chain is selected. Next, select the Kusama Relay address that you want to send the KSMs from. Enter the amount of KSMs to transfer, and verify that the account listed is your Moon River account where you would like to receive the XCKSM tokens. Review the transaction details, and if everything looks all right, go ahead and click Send. The extension will pop up and ask you to confirm the transaction. So go ahead and enter your password and click Sign the transaction. The transaction could take a minute to confirm. Now you can see that your XCKSM balance has been updated in the DAP, and you've successfully transferred KSM to Moon River. Just keep in mind that the transaction fees have been deducted from the amount transferred, which is why your XCKSM balance is a little bit lower than the amount you transferred. You can check that your KSM balance has decreased by using Polkadot.js apps, or by checking out a block explorer for Kusama, such as Subscan. So now that you have some XCKSM tokens, you could send some to another Moon River account if you wanted to. You could do so by opening up MetaMask, clicking on the XCKSM token, and then clicking send and filling out the rest of the information. But for now, let's just jump into withdrawals. When transferring the XCKSM back to Kusama, keep in mind that the associated transaction fees will be automatically deducted from the total amount transferred and will be paid in Kusama. So to withdraw and transfer the XCKSM out of Moon River back to Kusama, go ahead and click withdraw. Now you can start entering in all the information to begin the withdrawal. Select Kusama. Enter the amount of XCKSM to transfer. If you would like to send the max amount of XCKSMs back, you can enter an arbitrary amount that you know is larger than your balance and it will automatically default to the max. Enter the destination address on Kusama and review the transaction details and if everything looks all right, go ahead and click send. MetaMask will pop up and you can confirm the transaction. Once the transaction goes through, your balance on the DAP for XCKSM will decrease. 
And that's it, congratulations. You have successfully sent KSM to Moon River in exchange for XCKSM and XCKSM back to Kusama in exchange for KSM. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Thank <laughs> you.